To band a tree for cankerworm, there's several supplies that you'll need. Um, one of the most important things is you want to have a pair of disposable gloves. The material that you're going to put on, the sticky material, is very sticky, so you want something you can take off and be able to throw away. The first part that you're going to need that you're going to place on the tree is either a roll of cotton batting or pipe insulation. That's going to go on the tree first. You want to make sure that you're getting any little cracks or crevices because that female moth could crawl behind this, this batting material. So you do want it to be nice and secure in there so she can't get behind here. After you have that cotton batting up, you'll want to get some plastic wrap and you can buy this at any kind of moving type store. They usually sell this roll and that's going to wrap on top of the cotton batting. You'll want to go around the tree a couple times to get a nice good fit on there. And it is very sticky. It'll stick to itself. And you want to walk around and just make sure you don't have any areas that that female can walk behind it. The consistency of the tangle foot's kind of like caramel. Very, very sticky. If it's a really cold day when you're banding your trees, you might want to warm it up a little bit. Either you can stick it in the sun or you can put it in the microwave for just a couple seconds. You can either get a disposable putty knife or one that you can wash off when you're done. And then you'll just dip the tangle foot in and spread it across that black plastic wrap that's on the side of the tree. You want it to be about a three inch wide band on top of there and um, it doesn't have to be really thick where it's running, but you do want it thick enough to capture these insects. 